Welcome back. Let's take a look at what a uh, quiz problem that was generated from a previous game that I played. So this game, uh, sometimes opponents will analyze games with an engine after the game, and I think that's what causes these puzzles to be produced. Regardless, these puzzles feature a position where there's a correct move, and then there's the move I played. And here, I have a decision to make between blocking the check with my gold general or running my king away and losing this pawn and cutting my losses there. Observing also that this bishop will hit the silver. It's like every, well, this bishop's also hanging. So in massive time pressure, I picked this move. Uh, however, this ends up losing the gold as well as everything else, so the correct move is actually to run the king. Um, before this livestream started, the proverb that had been shown there was an early escape of the king is worth eight moves. And here, that is certainly the case. Yes, the opponent uh, gets to exchange pieces freely. Yes, this is unpleasant. Yes, I thought I was winning this game, and I am not winning it. This is an even game here, but the move I selected in the game just loses, so you gotta uh, stay alive in order to win the game, um, at least to some extent. There are exceptions where if you can checkmate faster, then you don't have to worry about that, but anyway, that out of the way, uh, let's play some 10-minute games on Shogi Wars. Oh, now I see what the now matching overlay really looks like. Good luck. Right hand fourth file rook, it says. All right. Let's see this together. For once, I have the confidence to play this. I forget if they take with the bishop, what's my best response? Um... I also forget the best way to deal with this. I assume this is okay, but I don't really know. Okay. Um, I think this is also playable. Interesting. Um, hmm. Oh, this pawn has moved. They could have dropped a bishop here at any point. Um, mm -hmm. Well then, we need to take this, otherwise the silver won't hang in any of the lines where I'd gain a tempo from hitting the silver. Um, yeah, I've created an extremely yucky mess here. Whenever they push this a second time, I have to do something about this threat. Because this bishop could retreat back this way. And here I'm saying that, okay, I'm letting you promote. It's fine. Just, oh. Okay. Uh, I was playing Gota, right? But here, the opponent insists on giving me the turn. Interesting. So let's take this tempo. They defend this point. Um, hmm. I don't know everything about this, but I think this is fine. Comfortable, no. Acceptable, I think so. Um, hmm. I don't know what to do.
this is sharp, no. But um, I don't think we did this right. Okay, this sets up a threat to check my king. Um, I can deal with this threat, though. I don't have to leave my king here. I'm confused. <laughs> yes, it looks spooky, but let's get beyond that. Um, so I think this bishop drops pretty inflexible. Um, I defend my pawn, and maybe I've missed something absolutely critical here, but I think this position is playable, perhaps considerably better for me. So my bishop continues its promotion threat. Um, I'm also threatening to trap this rook. Also, the bishop is fully trapped. Uh, I'm going to continue protecting this pawn. Although I might let the pawn go soon. Depending what the opponent's willing to sacrifice, the pawn might not be relevant anymore. Uh, but yeah, I'm threatening to push this to win a bishop. Um, hmm. I could take this, but then they can attack my knight faster. So taking's a very bad idea. Oh, this escapes the bishop. That's the point. Um... I might try to trap my bishop, but I don't see that trap here. All right, I'm tired of this bishop being here. You can retreat. Um, and then is capturing the rook my best idea? Or is there something better? I think capturing the rook is probably good. I'm nervous that I'm missing something crucial, but I have to make... Oh, look! Talking about missing something crucial, that was the point. Um, this is me exerting confidence in the face of weakness, and doing so incorrectly. All right. Um, Go -fun. Yep, I fucked up. So how do I get out of this? How do I survive this situation? Um... First of all, not get this trapped forever. Oh, that's a problem. Problems have solutions. Well, let's try to focus on the solution part of it. Um, okay. So my opponent's about to get a knight. I'm about to get 
a promoted pawn. It's not the end of the universe that they get a knight. Trying to trap the rook has not worked out at all. Um, um, oh, they get a promoted pawn also. Am I okay with that? Maybe. No, I'm not. But I can't do anything about it, so let's worry about things I can do things about. Um, so I have a promoted pawn. They get a promoted pawn. We all get a promoted pawn. Everybody promotes. Mm -hmm. Do I? T yeah, I have to take this. I can't just let that sit there forever. Because then that swiftly chases back after my king. That's a mouse slip. We take those. Um, which way do I go? It seems obvious, but maybe it's not. Hmm. This is sad. It would be nice to save the rook if I could. I don't think I can. Um, running from a fork. Yep. You caught me. I'm running from a fork. Uh, what a mess. Let's take one of those. Hmm. That's also annoying. Um. Nifun. My horse is not defending my king, so it needs to go. Yeah, maybe I could have taken this instead of running. Running doesn't actually help me here. I have so many gold generals, I should just drop one, but I'm concerned they'll exchange all my pieces and I die. So I don't want to exchange any more than I need to. Um, plus, right now they don't have a gold, so it's kind of hard for them to defend their back rank. Oh, goodness. Well, I have decisions to make. Um... Somehow this is going to be fine. <laughs> it's not, but it has to be. Oh, goodness. That's not the move I wanted to play. Uh, though it does look cool. Uh...
Why did I do that? I could have used the other token. I thought this was attacking my rook. Remembering how the pieces move is hard. It shouldn't be. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Panicking's not going to help here. Oh, mate in one. Not, not mate in one, but like, this is pretty bad. Jubio. Thanks for the game. Well, I messed that up somewhere. I don't know where. But let's keep trying. One down, two to go. Good luck. I'm not going to see side pawn capture here. I'm not in the mood for it. Interesting. What are the odds of Otabisha here? Alright, what's our proverb? Okay, king... <laughs> they finally moved the king to a safer space. Let's exchange here. Now, I keep being told when my king's over here, don't push this pawn. So this time, not going to push it. The one time I'm going to uh, pay attention to the advice I'm given and see just how badly things go when I follow the advice. Um...
I think I push this pawn twice and hope for some tactic to show up somewhere. I could... No, moving the lance up while reasonable in some openings here doesn't do anything because the bishop's not on this diagonal. Uh, that's amazing. Um, sure, I guess I could return this favor. Okay, they stop my advance here. So... What the heck do I do? I can drop a bishop here at least this turn, but it's not safe. Um, if eventually I get a pawn, I can try to trap the silver, which is also an unsafe strategy, but like... Hmm. I had to move this up to defend against a bishop drop. The silver has wandered far from its king, so... Hmm. Yeah, I don't really know what to do. They want to bring the rook over, which is the reason they've not moved either of these generals that protect the entire back rank anyway. Um, um, well, huh. All right. Let there be fireworks. This point's not defended, so my rook might take this and take that and take this. It's not going to get to that point, but that's the threat. What does the opponent do? Also, I'm threatening a bishop drop to take either this or that. If I take here, I'm threatening this also to promote here if the rook moves. So, finally, I'm threatening like moving this pawn up and dropping a pawn to win a silver, but they're going to push this. They're very clearly intending to attack my king, and I don't know what to do other than this aggressive looking thing, but it doesn't look right. But I don't have anything else, so we're going to play the move that I have and not play the moves that I don't have. I guess this actually protects against a bishop drop there. I don't know if that actually was a threat in the first... Well, no, it wasn't. Because this was always a threat. But now it's just one step harder for this bishop to enter play. The silver's gone on a journey. And they did win a pawn. And they did keep open the option of bringing the rook over. It's just hard to keep every option open without there being some consequence. Um, Nanafun. All right, I activate my rook. That 
shouldn't come as any surprise. Maybe the surprise is that uh, they can kind of sort of trap my rook. And maybe I sack it if they do. I don't know. This is loose. Everything I have is loose here. But the king is also loose. So as long as I don't give them anything more than just pawns, I'm perhaps okay with this. Um, the silver might retreat, and then I might have to run the rook back. Oh. Okay. A race, then. A race, where their rook becomes active instantaneously. And mine hasn't yet promoted. Uh, that's an interesting concept. Hmm. Not sure what to do about that. I can't stop the rook from dropping or promoting in all of these spit. Well, if I were to redrop my rook, I could. It doesn't feel right. Taking here looks dangerous. Oh, they drop a bishop and win my gold, and I don't get to do anything, so yeah, I'm stuck doing this. Uh, they're threatening to drop a pawn back here, if I do anything too severe. Um, so we'll put the rook on the crazy square. We much would have rather put it in the opponent's camp than our, in our own, but uh, I didn't have a good option to put it in the opponent's camp. I do still have bishop drop threats, and I think they need to drop their rook to deal with my bishop drop, but um, could be wrong. Also, this edge attack looks pretty scary. Interesting. What's the purpose? I either take it or move sideways. Uh, moving sideways doesn't help. Go. I take it.
That's scary, isn't it? <laughs> if they had another square to drop a rook on, I would be doomed. Um, now they have one. Well, I would be in severe danger. Doomed is a bit overstating it. Sampun. Nifun. Thanks for the game. Well played. Two down, one to go. Good luck. Hmm, what to do? I've already blundered the pawn. Um... Well, let's try this way. Let's see what happens. Okay, you got the pawn. Congratulations. Um... Yeah, I don't know what to do here. This is what happens when I've messed up the opening beyond repair. They protect the silver. 
I mean, there are holes everywhere, and potentially holes could be exploited, but... Um, well, that's interesting. So, there are two pawns up. I don't fully grasp the danger of the situation. Um, perhaps this is extremely dangerous and I just don't know it yet. I don't know. Huh. Didn't know that effect would play. Now we know. Okay, what? Seriously? What have I missed? They're threatening a silver drop here, maybe? This doesn't make sense. Pawn takes, silver, knight takes, knight takes, gold takes, silver takes, bishop takes, bishop takes. Okay, so I need to activate the bishop up here. And if we exchange bishops, I win a knight. But my rook is loose. I don't know. I think they expected pawn takes. Or I... I don't know where they're at. Where are you going, sir? This is where you're going? Chasing my rook. Okay. I can live with that. Um... So, my rook can go here. Oh, they might push the pawn, the center pawn. <laughs> the one protecting their king. Um, they could push it. Pushing the center pawn would be legal here. Uh-huh. Okay. I hear ya. Um... I'll tuck the rook over here and see if they'll spend two tempi to try to chase it down. I didn't want to surrender the rook this way. Not in this position. Um, hmm. How do I not... That's amazing how the attack propels itself forward. It's kind of unbelievable. Um, I don't have a pawn in hand. Alright, that looks like a decent square for a bishop. I can take this square, and if I take this, then I can block the rook from promoting. And if the rook doesn't promote, I might survive this. So, that's the plan.
They might cut my root horse's ability to protect this. Um, they have pawns in hand. I do. Oh wait, they can't drop a pawn on this file. Um. Gofun. And this cuts the rook, so it's not going to promote. That's a huge blunder. Well, no, they can protect their rook now. Um... It felt like a huge blunder because my rook escaped, but their rook also escapes this. Um, I'm not so concerned about this lance being captured. I'm amazed I don't have some amazing extraordinary come back here i mean to me it looks like i'm making forward progress right the king's in the middle i'm moving toward the castle the silver is kind of sort of near my king but we can see clearly i'm marching forward right toward the king so that can't be too bad I don't know what my next threat is, however. If I had a gold in hand, then knight um, 5-7 here would be awesome, because then I could threaten a gold drop mate. But right now, a knight drop, they just move the gold away, and what's my knight doing here? It does look awesome. It might support some future idea, but I don't see it yet. Uh, interesting. So I could exchange pieces here. I should exchange pieces here? No. They gain Tempe if I do. What can I do with this tempo? <laughs> if I completely ignore things, they pursue my king, and that's terrifying. So maybe I do... Hmm. It's not easy. All right, you convinced me. I don't need to take both times, but I think is this profitable to do it this way? Sampun. Hmm. If they take, then I drop the lance. Yes, obviously they don't take that way. Um, as for what to do now, it's not so clear. It would be great to defend my king, but there's not a... It's a bit late to build a castle here. Um, 2 hours 30 minutes. Even so, if they insist I must, then I must.
2分1分30秒。It's crazy because they can drop a pawn right here. Well, then I can maybe take the bishop, actually. It didn't cross my mind until just now. Um, thank you. Ippun. That's. <laughs> I'm playing a very dangerous game. With that, with that drop. I panicked. This is no good. I'm sorry, this is. scary? This might have some good, but it's very difficult. Jubio. Fucked up. It's really hard to checkmate in this game. Thanks for the game.
I had to promote there, but still it's not fast enough. Well played. Nicely done. Shows I need practice. All right. Hope we enjoyed this series. You can't win them all. You can lose them all. Thanks for watching. See you next time.